My name is Sophie Elizabeth Thompson. I'm a sculptor and I'm based in Barcelona. My role during the project um, was to create some sculptures to inspire um, a new collection, now called the Ceres Collection, um, which consists of a bath and two sinks. The brief of this collaboration was to work with a renowned artist, Sophie, to produce some sculpted artwork for us that we could use as inspiration to create a beautiful art collection. My inspiration, the, the, the first inspiration is my how I work anyway, it's, it's being present. And I think the presence and that calmness lends itself beautifully to the design of a, a bathroom collection. Um, but also water. I live by the sea and I went down to the sea and I took photos of the sea, how it rests in the, the sand and how the wind affects the sand and how it kind of sculpts the sand and it leaves these beautiful, calm, flowing indents and the water's still flowing but sort of very, very gently and it's that feeling of the movement and it's very feeling of the yeah, it's just, it's, it, it's not trying, it's just a natural mark in, in the sand. And for me, that was my biggest inspiration. The hardest part of a project like this is that we're starting out with a piece of artwork. We're starting out with something that has been very much crafted by hand. And, and there's, there's an essence and a soul to that. And in Sophie's work, you can really kind of see the, the movements and the flow and so you end up getting um, a collection which it, which still has the the same intimacy the same the same energy and the same kind of invitation to the consumer this range is very special because we had a great collaboration with Sophie to be able to create some art that you could have in your house in your bathroom and have a really dynamic space so the material that I use for the the for casting these uh, plaster sculptures, I used a type of resin, and this lent itself beautifully to the final curves and lines and forms of the sculpture. And it, in itself, it's 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 very similar, or not dissimilar, to the beautiful material that Victoria and Albert use for their baths. Um, in a sense that the lines and the curves in the baths and the final sinks will also have that feeling of the sculptures, the, the dignity of the sculptures and the, the initial marks that I created are also in this final collection. This product range is different because we started with a very organic form and this process just continuously changes throughout. We didn't know where the bath was going to finish. It was very fluid, it was very organic and in, in the end we came to a design that's very organic and fluid in itself. And none of the dignity of the lines or the curves or the marks are lost in the process. I think the, um, even down to the, you know, even down to the rim of the, the bath where it's sort of flowing and it's moving and the, the, the curves sort of reach up. Although the baths have to be flat to have to be practical for obvious reasons, they do have that fluidity and they have that movement and the lines curve around the bath. And it does have that sense of the flow and the, the natural feel of uh, one of my sculptures. I truly believe it's one of a kind. I think this collection will be the first of its kind. Um, not only a collaboration between an artist and a brand like ours, but someone who does what Sophie does, collaborating with with a material and a product that does what we do, it's, it's truly unique. For me, the final collection of the Ceres collection embodies calmness. It, it embodies that feeling of luxury, that feeling of being good to yourself, that you're worth it, the feeling that, um, that time where you can close the door, you know, light a scented candle, enjoy that moment by yourself, shutting out the rest of the world and really, really switching off and just being, being centered. I say letting go, just letting go and just being completely calm and relaxed.